GPS. To explain how to install WordPress on a virtual server, I will do it in three steps. The first step is to install a VPS in a cloud hosting. The best are DigitalOcean or Builder. In this tutorial, I will show you how to do it in both. The second step is to point the DNS of the domain to the IP of the server. And the first step will be to install WordPress and a free SSL certificate. Let's start. To create a server, you can do it with DigitalOcean or Builder. I have used both for a long time and both are incredible. I'll leave you a coupon of $100 for each one in the description. Once you are in the main panel, you have to create a new server. Now you have to select an operating system. To follow this tutorial, you can do it with Ubuntu 18.04 or Debian. Personally, I prefer Debian because it's more stable. Then select a plan. This is up to you. The larger the server, the faster it will be and the more traffic it will support. Then you can select the location for your server. It's better to choose the location closest to your target audience so that it can work faster. In the case of DigitalOcean, in authentication, you should choose one time password. But if you know how to install an SSH key, you can also do it. Name the server and just create it. Once you have created the server, it will have an IP address. You can see this on your DigitalOcean or Builder panel. So now you have to point the DNS of your domain to the IP address. To do this, go to your domain provider and look for the DNS section. In my case, I have it in Namecheap. Now you have to create two A records. Both should point to the IP address of the server. In host name, in one you have to put www and in the other you must leave it empty or if you can't type at. Then delete the DNS that come by default in your domain. You must wait at least 30 minutes after saving the changes to continue with the step 3. Now that you have the domain pointing to your new server, you must set up WordPress on your site. To do this, go to the DigitalOcean or Builder console that you will find inside the servers panel. In the console, you must log in with a username and password. In Builder, you will find on your server, but in DigitalOcean, you will receive it on your email. Now, to install WordPress, we will use the WordOps application. This app allows you to install WordPress easily with SSL certificate. You just have to run two commands that I leave you in the description. The first command you should type is to install WordOps on the server. It will ask you for your name and an email. Then WordPress must be installed in the domain with the SSL certificate. To do this, you must type the following command and replace example.com with your domain. And voila, you already have WordPress installed on a VPS with SSL certificate. The username and password to log into WordPress you will find here. So you should save it in a blog note or something. Then go to your domain slash WP admin and you can now start with your new site. That was it. 
subscribe to watch more videos like this.